Hello everyone. Today I want to welcome you to an episode of Happy Meadow Tales where we will follow Robbie the Rabbit and Benny the Squirrel and others in adventures and fun things that happen in the meadow. Join me as we get started on the new one. Robbie and Benny farewell to Grandma Bunny. In the heart of Happy Meadow, Robbie and Benny had a very special member of the family, and she was Grandma Bunny. She was wise, kind, and had a smile that could light up even the darkest day. She had watched over Robbie and Benny since they were young, sharing stories, teaching valuable lessons, and offering love and comfort when they needed it most. As the seasons changed and the meadow flowers bloomed and wilted, Grandma Bunny grew older. Her once vibrant hops slowed, and she spent more time resting in her cozy burrow. Robbie and Benny could see that their beloved grandmother wasn't lively as she used to be. One day, in the, as the meadow was bathed with a soft glow from the setting sun, Grandma Bunny had called Robbie and Benny to her side. She looked at them with eyes filled with love and said, My dear Robbie and Benny, it's time for me to hop over the rainbow bridge and join the stars in the night sky. I had a wonderful life filled with joy and love, and it's time for me to rest. Well, tears welled up in Robbie and Benny's eyes as they hugged their dear Grandma Bunny tightly. We'll miss you so much, Grandma, said Benny, whispering with a trembling voice. Grandma Bunny smiled and patted their furry heads. Remember, my sweet ones, that even though I won't be here with you, I'll always be in your heart. I'll be watching over you just like the stars in the night sky. Well, as the passing days, Grandma's health declined, and one chilly night, she peacefully hopped over the rainbow bridge. Robbie and Benny were filled with sorrow. Their hearts were heavy with grief. They spent quiet moments in the burrow, remembering the wonderful times that they'd shared with Grandma Bunny. They laughed at the stories that she told and cherished the wisdom that she had imparted. They felt the warmth of her love surrounding them. Robbie and Benny knew that even though Grandma Bunny was gone, her spirit would live on with the lessons that she had taught them and the love that she had given. They shared stories about her with the other meadow animals, and together they held a beautiful memorial service in her honor. In the days that followed, Robbie and Benny discovered that the meadow was filled with friends who cared for them just like Grandma Bunny did. They found comfort in the support with their furry and their feathered friends who offered hugs, kind words, and a sense of togetherness in their time of grief. As they watched the stars twinkle in the sky, Robbie and Benny felt that Grandma Bunny's presence was a gentle breeze or the rustling of the leaves. They knew that she was always part of their lives, guiding them with love and wisdom that she had shared. And so, Robbie and Benny faced the loss of their beloved Grandma Bunny with sadness in their heart, but also with gratitude for the love and the memories that they shared. They knew that life in the meadow would go on, and they would continue to honor her legacy by being kind, wise, and loving to others that they had met. The End